Hey everybody, it's Ramona, welcome back. Um, I have a Scentsy haul here today. It's actually two hauls, uh, and it's actually just in time because although I do have quite a bit of Scentsy wax in my closet, a lot of them are repeats that we've already talked about on Scentsy Saturday, so we're getting some new ones in, so that's really great. Uh, so first of all, okay, so this, first of all, <laughs> This is a diamond drill, uh, which I'm finding all over my house now. They stick to your feet or they, when you open a box, there's like one here and one there. Found one in my bed. Um, so my house is either covered in wax strips or diamond drills. So that's how I'm going to go out. Uh, anyhow, okay, so the first part of the order is my Scentsy Club order. And if you aren't familiar with Scentsy Club, um, it's a... A subscription service just like everything has a subscription service now my face mask makeup bag you know anything has a subscription service and uh, so this is Sensi's subscription service so you can put wax in your cart you can put laundry detergent car bars anything that's usable there's a term they're using but if it's usable uh, it can go part be part of the Sensi club so you can order it you can have so it comes on auto delivery as subscription boxes are either one month two months or three months you can change the time frame and you can also change what's in your box coming in your following boxes now what's important to know about the Sensi Club is that you can get discounted bricks and all this is on the website check on the on Sensi website if you have a a uh, consultant already, talk to your consultant, go to her website or his website. Or if you don't have a consultant already and you're in the US, uh, my consultant is Lisa Roberry. She is fantabulous. Uh, if you're in Canada, use Patricia Getz, G-A-E-T-Z from Nose to Toes. She has a YouTube channel here, as does uh, Lisa Roberry as well. So those gals are fabulous. Um, okay, but anyway, so you can get Scentsy Bricks discounted and you can also order the most previous uh, or, um, choices of Bring Back My Bars. For instance, uh, Lemon Lavender, which I know you probably can't see that, Lemon Lavender uh, is a Bring Back My Bar. You can't get it anymore, but I got it into my cart before that last guns were fired of this bring back my bar. There's a couple actually bring back my bars here. So if you put a bring back my bar in your Sensi Club order, you can continue to get it forever and a day as long as it's in your cart. It doesn't matter that it's not available on the website, it's in your cart and you will continue to get it. If you take it out of your order at any future uh, subscription boxes in the future, you're null and void, you're not gonna get it back. Once you take it out, it's gone. Okay, so anyway, I'm not gonna get too much into the Scentsy Club because, you know, we'll talk to your consultant about that. So this first order is my uh, Scentsy Club order, um, and I'm down for, I believe, every two months. Uh, you can also use the Bundle and Save pack, so I got six bars for the price of five because you get one free bar when you do the, uh, um, uh, club, what's this? I just said the word, I just said it. Okay, moving on. So what I have in my pack, I swear to God, you guys, when I turned 54, it went all downhill. My mind, my memory, my body, I'm getting biopsies for this and biopsies for that. I'm a mess. I'm a total mess. But I have my wax. Okay. I guess I'm talking bundle and save. I think that's the word for it. I don't know, whatever. Okay. So the first one is new to me. I keep doing this. I'm, I'm very cognizant of that. I'm trying to do I'm also cognizant of the fact that I say um a lot. And I'm trying not to do that. We'll see how this goes. Okay, uh, blueberry pancake. So this is new to me. And Lisa was saying on a, on a chat or on her one of her pa one of her um, YouTube videos that uh, her husband used to love um, blueberry cheesecake. Uh, but once he smelled this, he loved this one much better. And I do like blueberry scents, so I am going to give it a try. Since he says it's blueberries and butter, a cord over light maple, make the mood. Definitely the maple, I'm getting the maple first. A little bit of background of blueberry. Um, 
But again, you know, sometimes you can't tell th how things are going to be until you melt them. Buckleberry. This is a repurchase for me. I love this one. Bursting fresh berries atop buttery blanket of crumbly coffee cake. Yep. And it was definitely berry and you got the bakery, you got the cake in there as well. So I really enjoyed that one. Coastal strawberry repurchased for me a few times over. Earthy fruity strawberry vine and raspberry seeds over jasmine petals. And my uh, handwriting now is pretty atrocious because nobody, you know, I don't write anymore. Everything's on the computer. Okay, so while I love this, obviously I did because I've repurchased it several times, so I do love it. I wish it was stronger. It's light. Uh, definitely, though, you get the <sighs> strawberry vines is what you're getting. And a little bit of a berry note. Slightly jasmine, slight floral but basically it's like the strawberry vines and it's a really, really lovely scent. I really, really enjoy it, but it's the, it's light. The throw is not that good. So I, but I keep buying it because I like it. So it does really good, like in a bedroom or small, you know, like a bathroom and this, not a big, not big area, but you know, combined, you know, kitchen dining, it's, it gets lost a little bit, I have to say, but I still like it. Uh, one that I do love that doesn't get lost is Lemon Lavender. Now, this is one of the Bring Back My Bars that I was able to put in my cart. I have two of them, and I'll probably keep two in my cart until I have a pretty good stash of this because I really, really like it. Eventually, I'll probably go down to one, um, but I do want to really build up my stash of this. Uh, tangy Lemon and Sweet Lavender Flowers. Um, Yes, and as I said when I hauled it or when I did a Scentsy Saturday, um, it is 50% lemon, 50% lavender. It is, it does lean cleaner to me, but I don't mind. I really, really like it. It made my house smell fabulous. It made my house smell clean, really, really clean. I really, really love that one. So I do want to stock up on that one. And finally, in my Scentsy Club order, which I did, I got this, I think Thursday or Friday of last week, is Snow Place Like Home. And the closer I get, it doesn't want to focus. So, hmm. you'll have to trust me on that. Stay in and chill out with cool mint and an accord of fresh air. There's that word again, accord. Now, this to me, this is nice. Uh, uh, Patricia Getz, uh, Canadian uh, YouTuber slash Sensi consultant, nose to toes, uh, melted this and it was really light for her. She said she hardly got any throw at all. So I'm really hoping that I get a good throw because I do like the scent. It is minty. It is kind of uh, wintry. Yeah, mint and fresh air. I really like it. I really, really like it. Um, and so I might keep that one in for the next order or two as well to get a couple to get a couple more of those. Okay, so that was the Scentsy Club order. That's separate. Now today I got a new order in that um, I ordered a few days ago. Uh, Lisa was on a live chat and was talking about warmers and some new scents and what have you. And so I did order two warmers. I had no intention of doing that. Well, nor did I have any intention of order any of this. You know, my intentions are always good, um, but they fall through the wayside somewhere along the line. So I did get five bars again, bundle and save, six bars for the price of five. So if you're ordering five bars, always go to the bundle and save section because for the same price, you'll get that sixth bar. So that's always a good deal. Um, so let's talk about the wax first. Uh, apple butter frosting, which is quite a long story. Let this heartwarming medley of baked cinnamon spiced apples and decadent vanilla buttercream be the icing that finishes your holiday decor. I really just need a scent note sensor. That's all I need. And these ones, those ones I did smell. These I've not even opened yet. I just unboxed them a few minutes ago. Uh, I did not open the clams on purpose. Definitely it's buttercream. A little more cinnamon than apple. Yeah, definitely more cinnamon than apple. So I'm getting kind of like a cinnamon buttercream right now. So hopefully when I melt it, the apple will come out. 
breakfast blend. Uh, I still love my coffee scents. Get buzzed on the pure scent of rich, just brewed coffee. Brown wax. I haven't done my nails like in so long because I'm like all about the diamond painting now and I never go anywhere without my nails painted. That's good. It is coffee, but there's something in the background there that's um, kind of throwing me off. There's another scent in there. I don't know what it is. It's not spice. Something, I, I can't even explain it. Is it bakery? I don't think so. I don't know. I'll have to wait and see how that goes when I melt it. Butter pecan, which I believe is this month's scent of the month. Again, if fall had a flagship fragrance, this blend of candied pecans and maple folded with butter would be a strong contender. I'm looking down because my notes are here. I know you know that. Oh, that's good. That definitely, I'm getting kind of like a butter pecan. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, I know. I knew I'd like that. Definitely butter pecan. Is there a hint? In, is there a hint of any spice in there? I feel like I'm getting a little hint, like just barely a whiff, barely a whiff of cinnamon. Maybe not. Maybe not. I thought I, I thought I smelled it there. Uh, cozy chai. Warm, spicy cinnamon, vanilla bean, and caramel. Kind of like a tan wax. Oh, that's good. Um, definitely I'm getting vanilla and caramel. Ah, come on. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay, it doesn't want to pop out. Caramel and vanilla. I'm not really getting any chai spices right now. Like I should be getting some cardamom right off the top. We'll see. We shall see. Honey pear cider. Uh, the scent of pure autumn bliss and fresh juicy pear and sweet honey together with subtle hints of spices. Oh, that's nice. Definitely I'm getting pear. Wow, that's really, uh, I'm, I'm glad to hear that because I don't order a lot of wax with pear because in my experience, the pear doesn't come out, it gets lost or it smells like apple or it just doesn't smell authentic. But this one, I can smell pear and it's distinguishable as pear. So I think I'm gonna like that one. Hopefully it'll even get better when I melt it. And winterberry apple tea, winter tea, Cozies up to cranberry, apple, and honey. So now this is a favorite of Lisa. I think it's a favorite of Patricia Getz. Uh, I've heard a couple people talk about this one. And I think um, Lisa went to visit Melanie, Mr. Kong's mom, and they had a video of their favorite, I think, fall and winter scents. And actually they melted, they made their own little blend and they melted this with something that I can't recall. Oh, that's really good. I am getting the tea. This um, this is really nice. I like this. There's definitely some spice in here. I'm short sure cinnamon, um, but that's really really nice. Um, and I did I get like cranberry? I can get like a berry slash apple with a little bit of uh, cinnamon. Okay, so then to finish off, um, again, I had no intention of doing either of these, but the first one I got <clears throat> was on sale um, the day that Lisa had her live um, chat. And so she wasn't particularly, uh, <coughs> pardon me, demoing this one, but a few of us had questions about it when she said it was on sale. So she did go to the other room. She pulled it out for us to show us. And it is the cozy, I think it's called, uh oh, Christmas Glow. It's called Christmas Glow. And it is a big red Christmas ornament. And it is like etched, the glass is etched there. Um, I did plug it in over there. My extension, I don't have, I, I have an extension cord, but I don't know where it is. I didn't go looking for it. Um, so this one I eyed all last 
winter season, Christmas winter season. And Lisa would show it to me on multiples of times. She talked to me about it multiples of times. She sent me pictures and I was just so on the fence because every time I would see a video or a photo of hers or even I also YouTubed other um, Sensi consultants to see what their video was like. And it was all the same. The light bulb, which is obviously right there, the light bulb, only because of the filming, all you could see was just a, a bright white light. You couldn't really see the texture of the glass. All you could see was the white light. And so I reluctantly didn't order it and I just kept, it's like, no, no, I'm not gonna do it. And she just kept trying to reassure me. It's like, no, I'm okay, I don't need it. So when she did it again this year, it's like, you know what, I'm just gonna order it. If I don't like it, I'll return it or whatever I'm gonna do. I am so, so glad I ordered this. Lisa, I am so thankful that I finally ordered it. Sorry for being a butthead last year. I should have ordered it last year. It is gorgeous when it's lit up. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So this was on sale. I believe I paid $35 or $40 for it, down from $50, I believe. Today, of course, uh, it was on sale for the flash, Sensi Flash sale that completely blew up the internet. And it was $10. And man, oh man, am I ever ticked off that I paid $40 for it. But anyway, I, I love it. I love it. I love it. And it's gone now. On Of course, it flew out the door on the um, flash sale. And so, and the dish is, the dish is decent. It's a, a little bit deeper dish. Short, smaller in diameter, but deeper. So definitely four, uh, not four, two cubes will fit in there. I always usually use two cubes uh, in most of them, most of my warmers. So that is stunning. Now, um... Uh, you every few years I changed the theme of my Christmas tree one year it was like silver and that icy blue color um, but the last couple years it's been red balls with cardinals stuck in here and there and um, plaid bows like tied on the end of the some of the limbs so mainly it's 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 red so that it's gonna go good with that and then I missed this part because I came into the chat late, but they were talking about the cardinal warmer. It's like, wait, cardinal warmer? So, like I said, I put little cardinals all throughout my tree, um, and so, I mean, how could I pass this up? I couldn't, and the glass is kind of like a mottled, frosted glass. Uh, the dish is the same. It's a little narrower, but it's deep enough, um, and I plugged this one in already, and this one also is really, really gorgeous. Do you know what? I didn't even look to at, think. Um, I don't, you know, Scentsy warmers admittedly are more expensive than, you know, what other Walmart, you know, um, Kohl's, whatever other warmers are out there. Um, you, you know, admittedly they are, but they're so beautiful. Now I have ordered a couple in the past that were like 12 watt, not a fan of the 12 watt at all. And I probably should have asked Lisa, or, you know, what the wattage is, but both of these are 25 watts. So that is going to be really, really good. So I'm so happy with both of these, um, warmers and even on sale, you know, they were a little bit more, but I have no regrets at all. They are really, really stunning, really, really stunning. So I'm so glad I got this last week because it's gone now um, and then I would regret it forever, but no regrets today. So that is my Scentsy haul. Uh, I hope everybody enjoyed it. And again, if you need some Scentsy consultants in Canada, mine is Lisa Roberry. She's fabulous. There's lots of fabulous uh, consultants out there, but Lisa, Fa Lisa Fabulous. Lisa Roberry is fabulous and she is my um, Sensi consultant. And in Canada, also just as fabulous is Patricia Getz, G-A-E-T-Z. So lo look up both those gals if you need a consultant. I hope everybody's having a great night and I will see you soon. Bye.